A-B-I-S-A-I, stay fly to the sky, Abbasai, a.k.a. Jordan Jams, a.k.a. Slim the Batty, real the Batty, what you say, your Batty, yeah, get Batty. And we got, we got to understand the connotation what defines a Batty. I thought Batty means you, you go after what you want. You know what you want, or you're learning what you want, and you have boundaries. Fighting does not always have to make you a baddie. That's what, that's the actual BGC. We're getting it from who? Miss Paula. Miss Paula. Yes. Fighting does not make you a bad girl. I know that's right. So <laughs> if you're new, welcome to the channel. This is my role-playing dating ASMR series where I basically do ASMRs of different role plays and we go from there. Honestly, I just go, I just be how I really would react to certain situations. So go figure. Besides, ain't like, ain't like there's anything out there. Subscribe, share the video. Thank you for watching. Let's get this started. So the first ASMR that we have, I really was not gonna return back to um to the last part to the last uh video where I was playing basically the role play was just I was triggered and I'm trying this again. I gotta face my fears, I guess. So it is part two of by playing Caden, beat it and leave this fanboy alone. Jock and fanboy football jock. Fan library. So this is where we're gonna head to the library. So and clearly he probably gonna do something about the bully that's right by the lot by the library. So we'll see how this goes. All right, bro. Come on, come on, chill out. No, come on, bro. Just just leave him alone. Just let him go. What was that? Right. Did you say that I'm protecting my little fin boyfriend? <laughs> also, boyfriend. you got jokes. Not fin boyfriend. You know, you're real funny. I got jokes, but not right now. Bro, you know that I can kick your ass. You're well, one. I'm Only 5'9. Five, nine. Five, nine. Oh, I'm pretty sure even this fin boy you're picking on could even kick your ass too. You must not know who I am. You must not know about me. You must not know about me. You sure effing don't. <laughs> Bitch, I'll, I'll, I'll. I'm ready. I'm ready. Go if you want to if you want to try, but I, that's why I try to be zen as hell. Cause I know I, I bitch. Once this comes off, everything comes off. Or it's just it's gonna be be Dragon Ball Z. It's gonna be le legit Dragon Ball Z super up in here. Just calm down. Don't do it with me. I'm just trying to. I'm just trying to party. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You want to go right now? Right here in front of your girl. You know what I've done to you in the past. No, you don't I'll let him go and get out of here. That's right. I beat it. All right, everyone. There's nothing to see here. Just oh, clear okay. the hallway and. Oh, okay, and so so you oh so so all of a sudden we just we just skip past to everything and and I thought I would have heard a you know at least a punch or. 
that, that kind of like pulling up the shirt, pulling up the shirt, pulling up the shirt, pulling up the shirt, and. I thought I would hear something like that. Um, okay. But why do I bring up, like, what is so wrong about being a fanboy? I feel like, <laughs> only thing I got to say is, um, for someone who has to mask um, their femininity, especially when you're outside, but sometimes I don't, I don't really do it all the time, but when it comes to certain situations that can be very, like, that can bring out the social anxiety and the the trauma in certain, certain aspects that I have dealt with and have to deal with it based on my speaking, my voice, um, it can be a lie. So, I'm, I'm I'm just feeling like he's saying it in a negative connotation, and I'm just like the trigger, tr- the triggerness in me is like, mm, 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 mm. Be- beat up my, beat up my, beat up my heart, beat up my heart, beat up my heart. So yeah, so okay, so he defeated the bully. What's that for you? Come here. You're supposed to be in the library. Get over there now. Now you making a I'll big scene. A what was that, bro? <laughs> you know oh, he's always yes. scared of me. All right, I'll catch you later though. I gotta run to the library really quick. All right, bro. Catch you at practice. That's crazy. That is crazy. Ugh, I don't like school. <laughs> I'll probably be the most smartest person in, person in the classroom, but in the end of the day, I never love school. Mm-mm. I love learning, but in school, mm-mm. Mm-mm. I was glad I had a period in my life where I was able to just like be homeschooled. I felt like the the, the learning process was much more better, hands on, um, that particular kind of thing. So yeah. I'm glad the library is quiet though. Shit. But it would be bad though if you was in here like had to let out a fart. A real wet, sloppy one. <laughs> what the hell was that? Now you have the whole school thinking that I was protecting some little femboy. You, you say you're sorry? sorry? No, no, it's too late for that now. I'm not I gave sorry. you one specific instruction, and that was to wait until the hallway was clear. Once it was clear, you were supposed to make your way here. I told you, you want about to the do. I told you about. And why the is do. that? Because you told to me that it would be to be late. <laughs> oh my gosh! This. Oh my gosh! What did? What this? What, is that? What is? I'm triggered. 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 <laughs> I'm triggered. So, yeah, like. I'm just like, baby, get get you some backbone. I know you got a little bit. I mean, I know you got a little bit of something. Get you some backbone. Shit, put your back into it. (laughs) 
That's why I'm probably single now. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you and I can say it's too late for that too. I was already disappointed just hearing that you were my partner for this project, so I'm, I'm pretty sure disappointed. the disappointment was I over just, a long I time just ago. Drop the hell out of school. <sighs> Come on, let's just get started. Go on. Take out your little school supplies and tell me what you've gotten done so far. Whoa, wait, wait. hold up. What's this? What? What are these? Drawings? <laughs> no, let go. Let me see what you got here. Give me my drawings. You don't need to see none of that. You're a little anime fan femboy, aren't you? <laughs> you sure like drawing a lot of muscle anime men. You're not drawing these because of I me, can. are you? You really, you, you really, you really, you really, like, just, just, like, just, just, but see what I'm saying? Like, why I have to deal with that shit? I don't have to deal with it, but why OP has to deal with it? The person who's who's imagining this, they might have a little, uh, you know, maybe a bit social anxiety than damn self. And you shaming them for loving anime? Oh my gosh. Dang, like, bitch, I see here. <laughs> see here, just saying, like, especially for somebody who's an anime fan, grew up. Grew up watching anime, saying hell, Loki, Loki have have made a little comic book <laughs> to to see him do all this. That that <laughs> triggered, especially like that's why I like like. <laughs> Because that would be pretty weird. Did you say give it back? Yeah, give, give the stuff back. <laughs> Not with that high squeaky voice of yours. Give the stuff back. Why don't you say it with a little bit more, I don't know, authority? Come on, come on, he's saying it like, give it back. And even if he is, why would, it doesn't matter, give this shit back. Get that shit back, or I'm, I'm, I'll, I'll, I will personally make you get that shit back. Like, put me, put me in the rain. 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 Go on. <laughs> Try using your man voice. <laughs> oh, did I hurt your feelings? You know, you're always going to be picked on because you make it easy. Now, if I were you, I'd probably hit the gym a time or two to toughen up a bit. Here's your little anime notebook back. Put me in the ring. Mm-hmm. Put me in the ring. Cause I'm just like, like, see, like that's it's that it's that 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 stuff that just that just grinds my gears. That grinds my gears. It's trick. It's like they don't have to toughen up a two. They probably need to get some more backbone. Okay, we can we can understand that. But they don't have to go to the gym. They don't need to go to the gym. How about you don't tease him for having a little anime notebook? Like how you said it. It's about tongues. It's about tongues a lot for me. And just because you like, oh, I don't mean to no harm. You mean every harm. Because you want to make them feel ashamed for liking things that you don't like. Do you understand that? That's 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 weird. And for somebody who who probably was 
like OP just staying to themselves because why they already be just iron you down for anything what you do. And it's like at this point, fuck them hoes and fuck them bastards. Okay, I did not come here to be accepted by you. I accept myself. And I want OP to accept that keep on drawing in that that little anime notebook. Make them muscle guys even bigger. Shit. Give them some 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 peck ass titty 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 titty. Shit. Um Get them some big ass, big ass booties. Like, do what you need to do. Small ways, but you gotta do at this point. Do what you do. Hell, even make the ones that even still, still got body, even if they just like, just got A cups. And, um, <laughs> and little booties matter. <laughs> okay. If any of these dudes in school get a hold of something like that, you probably should transfer out of here. You can't even say like all oh, these drawings are some nice. Future advice. Now let's get back to business. That's so. That's so, so. That is so so so. Is this really like? Am I supposed to like? Was was if part three comes out with 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 op. Just, just falling in love with him. I mean, stand up, stand up, stand up. That's when you need to stand the hell up. Well, you're not gonna, gonna do all that weird stuff. It's fine, fine alone. We people be weird thinking like you imposing. Their their life their life with your with, with who at who you are as a person as a being, and it's like it shouldn't come for you. I did not sit here come for you. I did not come for your acceptance. I came here to see and get the, <laughs> get the fuck out of school and graduate, bitch. <laughs> and you want to get in my way of my graduate graduation because you a hater. You a hater. You a hater and bitter. Like oh my gosh. Just better, bitter Betty's. Shit, I make lemonade out you hoes. <laughs> yes, I'm calling this dude, this bro, 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 a hoe. <laughs> but seriously though, I'm calling this bro a jerk. How much of the writing on those statistics were you able to complete? Two pages, you say? Yeah, I'm glad you did that shit. Well, the statistics is pretty easy. If you depend on what you, what questions you're asking about graphs, so I mean, we probably should maybe aim for four. That might make Mister T a little bit more impressed. So, if I were you, yeah, Mister T, Mister T, Mister T get a move on that see if if mr t now i see but mr t was supposed to stand up for for whatever in the show look that's why cartoon network cartoon network used to have those shows so okay whatever what am i going to do you ask hmm what i've been doing telling you what to do First of all, this is this is your grade. You don't want to pass, and you're telling me that I need to do all this. No, you no, you really got. At this point, I'm getting suspended. I don't care. I'm getting the F. I'll take the zero. I don't care no more, and I, I don't care no more. I can fight everybody at this point. I fight everybody. At this point. <laughs> I fight everybody at this point. Like, let's go. Like, this is just. Ugh. My heart, like, like I'm, mean, I, I just want, I just want, I don't care win or lose, I'm gonna still, still get my, get, get my hit sent on you, regardless, and they're gonna be damaging. I don't care if I get roughed up around the edges, bitch. I know I still got your ass. Like that's how it matters. <laughs> like please. 
Why are you worried about me anyway? This is also your great. You remember that. You should be lucky that I'm even partnering with you on this project. Partnering? Mr. T told us to partner. Did you say that's not fair? It's did really not. Did you just nice. forget what I did for you out there? You didn't want to do it for me. Like... Taking care of your bully for you? I didn't ask you I'm pretty sure I earned it to just kind of sit back and relax a little bit. I didn't ask you to. You're not going to tell on me, are you? <laughs> Look, let me just get through this football practice tomorrow, and I'll contribute a little bit more. Will that make you happy? Good. My focus right now is on the game. See, that's a real, I, I got a real mean temper. Real mean temper. That, that. Mm-hmm. I'm just like, no, a real person would have been like, how would you would do this if I was, if I was the jock, if I was the jock, so I did this for you out there. Look, I'll contribute. Don't worry, I'll contribute. I will contribute. And your drawings are, they might not be for me, but still, very nice drawings. Period. That's all you have to do. <laughs> but no, you have to sit here and keep on shaming them for 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 as they are talking about. Some, oh, you need you need to do this. You need to do that. How about you tell them another way? Like how about you wouldn't do that because you're trying to see and get get with my friend. And it's like, bitch, please, please. I mean, we we I'm I'm all I bet the video is already freaking. Oh, maybe twenty thirty minutes in from me ranting when I'm at home. Is that good enough for you, pretty boy? <laughs> pretty boy, because I'm not pretty. You didn't happen to tell your pretty friend about me, did you? Not really. Oh, you well, did. Oh wait, well, I did just to see and let her know what that four one one. I said you wouldn't want to. It date better not him. be anything offensive or embarrassing. He's an asshole. Okay, so you mentioned. Me to her and <laughs> you told her so that I thought she shit. was cute. Okay. Good boy. That's a little bit dare. of I wouldn't dare. I wouldn't dare. I could never. I could never. And then my girl will sit here and be like, bitch, if he trying to pull some shit with you, we can jump them together, bitch. Like, what's what's real what's really up? We can jump them together. Like, what you really on? I'd be like, oh. Because <laughs> at this point, he's in here, he's in here telling you all these things. And you want to sit here and try to force for some, a relationship that you can't even come up to the girl to do. Yeah. Yeah. Nah. Nah. Your points for you. Then saying good, so good boy. Good boy. Then saying you calling him down while he's sitting here doing statistics. Oh. Jesus, take the will for me. Jesus, take the will for me. <laughs> Shit, cause at this point I'm about to, I'm 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 about to... <laughs> after all <laughs> Did you tell her about my nice looks and my nice body? Oh you did. And how did you phrase that exactly? Hmm. That's you it. said that you thought I was handsome. I didn't think it was handsome. I think you. I think you're. You. You. You're probably cute in the face, but so what? Your personality nerd. is pretty shit. 
You probably should have maybe used the word sexy. I'm not sexy. I would have yeah. given you a pass if it meant I was going like to get grotesque. her number. <laughs> Grossy. Well, I appreciate the comment, but it doesn't sound yeah, like you talked me up like you should here. have. <sighs> I must say, once again, I'm pretty disappointed. But... I'll give you another Over chance. Here right now, trying to imagine somebody patting me on the back. Just as like, you know, this is our last year as seniors. Just massaging so me, trying to cool me. You'd really be making my ear if you could hearing this. do a better job at hooking me up with her. <laughs> She's not like that, you say? I can never. Trust not me. To my, not to my I dream. think even you would be that way if you had a chance with me. And I would hope my friend would not be, be the same way for me, bitch. I mean, girl, are you sure about him? Like, <laughs> girl, are you sure about him? Have you lost your mind? Like, it's something, it's something, it has to be something that's going on. It has to be. <laughs> like, <laughs> it, it has to be something going on. <laughs> Are you okay? Is it, do we need like to put some different eyes? Like, like something. Like, what's going on? <laughs> it's like, girl, what's going on? Talk to us. I'm over here, like, I guess that's my man, Danny. If you don't see what I see. <laughs> I'm, I'm laughing. I'm laughing to keep the mask, 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 all the, 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 F, the WTFs of what I'm thinking about. <laughs> Like, oh my gosh. <sighs> so, why don't you do your boy a favor and get me her number? Will you do that for me? In exchange for what? I'll take that quiet nod of yours as a yes. No, that's a shaken no. By the way, I was able to convince Mr. T to give us another week. This will give me a chance to play in the game this weekend, so we really need to hurry up on this project. Well, we it takes two to work to get work, all the right work done, on and this. I'll work on the graphs this weekend, so we can have it out by Monday. Got it? <laughs> but before you go, I have to ask you something. What? Why are you so afraid to stand up to your bully? I mean, he's pretty scrawny. I'm pretty sure with a little bit. Because I know. Because I please, please, please. No, no. Maybe it's a good no. Maybe y'all need to tell people to back the fuck up. And it's okay for for you to tell them back the fuck up. Because they didn't get down date. At this point, beat their ass. Beat their ass. Beat their ass. I don't care if they big or small, bitch. Beat their ass. Beat they ass. Beat they ass. Beat they ass. Like don't 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 try to run 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 away now and try to do all this other mess. Beat they ass. You see here one of the 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 target them for as they are. No, beat they ass. Like, like, no. And sometimes, like, I know, I know when, when I say beat their ass, but you better see and knock their ass out. They gonna need a motherfucking goddamn hospital. Oh, no. No, baby. No. That's why I just be like, I'm over here like just then. Like, let's just, are we gonna be, be, be better then? 
better than what we could, what we have done, or what we could have done. Mm. 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 That's why you should, it's great to have hobbies. Not every hobby has to be a mon uh, uh, a mon a mon monetization. Okay, but at least you got a hobby to to, to take out that rage. Rage, you could probably take him yourself. You don't know. Look, I hate seeing little wimps scared to stand up for themselves. What I did out there for you was to only be able to get you into the library and not waste any more of my time. Now I'm, I'm not going to do my that time again for you. This mess. So. I'm not always going to be here to protect that little pretty boy face of yours. My suggestion is the next time it happens, I think it's time for you to get a little bit dirty. What do you say? Well, you're right about that, but you, you're not coming at the, coming Why am I giving you advice, you ask? <laughs> Why are you giving me advice? Like I said, we're not friends. Oh, I I, if you was talking to me, well, pathetic, we never could be. That you won't stand up for yourself. We could never be. You really think that any other boys are going to look your way if you're being so fragile? I bitch, nobody don't give a fuck about that damn shit, bitch. I, I will sit here and, and, and really, for somebody who got a voice, who talks loud as hell and, and backs it up, I'm... Mm -mm -mm. Like, you know how this voice carries. This voice carries. This voice carries. This voice carries. That's why I'm like, no, some of y'all just don't want y'all y'all just don't want to to do anything. You just want to cause a problem and want to think everybody else is imposing themselves onto you. When bitch, nobody ain't doing shit to you, talking to you, speaking to you, even want to even breathe the air with you. You know, um, I just feel like from my standpoint, from my standpoint, from my standpoint, it's like, I ain't got nothing to say to you. You ain't got shit to say to me. You know, I just stay out the motherfucking way. You stay the fuck out of mine. And that's how it's motherfucking gonna stand on. Yeah, you better tell the grandma, sister's grandma, you better tell that shit, bitch. Excuse me. I should be saying, bitch. Wise woman, you better tell <laughs> You better tell it. You better tell it. Okay? So, yes. I don't think I've ever asked you, but you got a boyfriend? Well, and that, that's none of your concern. No. None of your concern. Well, if this project goes well, maybe in the future, in private, I could maybe give you a few pointers so that way you can try to protect yourself. Oh, How does that sound? Hell no, 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 no. And I say no. Once no, again, no, I'm assuming the no, shaking of your head no, means yes. No, no. That says no, no. And another thing. No, no, no. Speak no, up a bit more. No. I'm going to stop the face in a minute, bro. I'm bro, pretty sure. Bro, bro. Watch boy your you mouth like and watch school, your, your, may your appreciate hands. appreciate that. Why am I being so nice, you ask? Nice? Oh, fake. Look, okay. It's not always easy for me to be me, and I'm sure it's the same for you. So don't get it twisted. All right. Well, I got to take off in a bit here to go to practice. This weekend, I'll work on the graphs, and what do you say we meet up here Monday morning? before we have to give the presentation. Sure. Does that work for you? I don't know. Sure. All right. Like the morning. <laughs> uh, let me see your phone really quick. Yeah, I'm recording in the morning. <laughs> yes, come on. Give me your phone. 
make sure you unlock it. Now, I'm going to give you my phone number. Let me put it in here for you. Oh, not part three. Not part three. You will only need to use this for an emergency not, not safe for work or for, for any questions that are concerning the project. You got it? Once we're I don't want you I don't want you to be texting me talking about some what you're doing doing late later tonight. Bitch, I don't you, you ain't gonna catch me later tonight. Bitch, if you can't see me in the motherfucking goddamn day. For starters, bitch, for somebody who's uh, who don't like eating in the morning, you can't see me in the day. Who the hell are you? Who are you? To be calling on my oh bitch. New phone, who's this, bitch? Plus, we're gonna delete it. And remember, no talking to me in front of the others. You understand? Now be a good boy and leave before me. No, oh, bitch. No. No, be a good boy and leave before me, bitch. You about to see Hanky D. You about to get the, the jolly good boy rancher routine with these fists, bitch. Because you a bitch. And not the good type of bitch. You're a punk. You're the wimp. F that, F that football mess. F all that. F all that. Be his ass. Be his ass. Have no right to sit here. You just put me in the fucking damn ringer. Like, you ain't gonna come over here and, like, and there's a non safe for work version. Oh, that might, that might be some somebody who really likes a degrading kink. I'm just like, why can't it, like, like, bitch, there's a difference between being, if you have a degrading kink, it's the difference between seeing and degrading them and then knowing that at the end of the day, after all that said and done, um, you still, you, you reassure them and let them know that positive reinforcement. Instead of just like not just just saying, oh well, you still just gonna be ain't shit, right? Anyway, I can't, I can't. That's so much. Oh, the second ASMR I have is by Bear Boss. Seven minutes in heaven with the himbo sub. Okay, so it, this seven minutes of heaven should be it, it better be be enough for me. Oh, that's what it's titled with the with the video says fourteen fourteen minutes. It's nothing wrong. I'm just gonna. I'm just saying. There's this. I'm just saying the obvious at this point. Are you sure it landed on me? I mean, it it was it was yeah. kind of in the middle. I'm not a chicken. I'm just making sure. Did we look at it really close? Uh, maybe we were just looking at it from the wrong angle. Probably. Okay, I'm going. I'm going. Quit shoving me. Uh, I'm that just beat saying is bumping. That. We need to get back. Uh, Damn, it's really dark in here. Oh, it's dark. oh shit! Oh, damn it! Fuck! No, it, it's fine. I sorry. I just didn't realize that someone was already in here. Well, yeah, I I know how this works. I just didn't realize that someone else was already in here. Honestly, no. I kind of stopped paying attention because I was. Well. Promise you won't tell anyone? I promise. Oh yeah, I, I promise. It's for a good reason. I was rigging the game with my friends so one of our buddies would get the chance to make out with the person that he's been crushing on for like the past year. Uh, we saw a chance to set them up, so we decided to take it. We just used that trick where we put a magnet in the top of the bottle and put the other half behind him so the bottle would land on him. It did. Yeah, we were all celebrating that it actually worked when they told me I was up. 
I hadn't even meant to join the game, but apparently they have a house rule of if you want to watch the game, you have to play the game. I just joined the game thinking that it could help hook my friend up and then ditch afterwards. Mm -hmm. I didn't think I'd get picked and actually have to play, but well, here I am. I can't say that I regret it since I was helping a friend, but I honestly feel pretty bad that you got stuck with me. I I mean, you were here expecting someone who was playing the game with the actual intention of, you know, playing the game. (laughs) Instead, you got me, someone who's so out of his element and has no idea what to do. Well... Honestly, no. I don't usually go to parties like this, especially if I don't know the person who's hosting. I know that people I think that I go to parties all the time, but between practice, you. games, and trying to keep my grades up so I don't get kicked off the team, I don't have a lot of time. I'm just, uh, uh, I love a, Henry. Respect, a respectable man. Oh, okay, yes. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. Oh, where's my... Right now, I do not feel like bringing that out. I show, I show, show, show. Let me do it. <laughs> like, a respectable man. A respectable man. Yes, he, he balanced schoolwork and, and, and know how to, how to, how to, how to still hit, for, um, do great for the team. That's what I'm talking about. I'm going out with them, but parties like this are actually kind of new for me. Not to mention, I don't like huge parties, so even if I do have time, uh, there's usually something else I'd rather be doing. Nah, I went to a couple in my first year, but I just didn't really like the feel of it. Frat parties are like, I don't know, they they feel different. House parties with your friends are fun, it's just everyone hanging out, and even if there's some people you don't know there, so what? Uh, friends of my friends are my friends too and all that mm. but frat parties have a different vibe altogether and it just kind of sets me on edge which is probably why i've never really done anything like this i've never been to a party where they did something like seven minutes in heaven i didn't think people actually played things like this at parties hey. nope never yeah. this is my first time playing me too <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm a little nervous. I'm about to make out with a stranger in a dark closet. I mean, I can't even see you. How am I supposed to kiss you at all, let alone make sure you enjoy it? You figure it out. I'll let you it. take the lead, huh? Okay, I can do that. It sounds good. Uh, really good, actually, but... Uh, Where are you? I know this closet is pretty small, but I have no idea where you are, and I can't really see you. Oh, (sighs) you are right in front of me. Uh, It's fine. I just didn't expect to feel a hand on my shoulder all of a sudden, but it's good to know where you are. Yeah, I'm I'm okay. Just still kind of nervous. That sounds good. We'll just take it nice and slow, and you'll take the lead. I'll just do as you say, and you'll help me out if I need it. Yeah. You know, you're really good at pep talks. Do you have to comfort nervous guys often, or is it a natural talent? It's probably natural. Only sweet guys. That makes sense. I don't think that... Hey, wait. Uh, Don't call me sweet. If you start oh. complimenting me like that, I'll, I'll start blushing. Because oh. it's oh, you're sweet. You're sweet. You're sweet. You're sweet. Yeah. <laughs> see how the see how the attitude just changes. It just changes. It just changes. See how the attitude just changed when it's the right person. (laughs) 
<laughs> and not somebody pretending to be the right person. But um, you just feel it like that. Like, sweet, don't call me sweet. Like, you're singing. It's really obvious when I do. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't say that. I am not cute when I blush. How would you even know? It's way too dark in here for you to see my face. I can see. <laughs> Quit that. Saying that I sound cute counts as complimenting me. Thanks. I appreciate you holding off on the compliments. <laughs> nervousness and more nervousness make for a pretty bad combo. Though, now I'm worried about what you mean when you say that you're going to try and get me more worked up later. Yeah, I'll just try to ignore it, but you've got me curious now. <laughs> what do you have planned for me? Aw, oh, but why tell me later when you could just tell me right now? Because it'll ruin the surprise. Oh, right. We're about to make out. That's a pretty good reason to wait until later to do something else. At least, I think it sounds like a good idea. Uh, kissing you sounds really nice. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess I am. It was pretty cool of you to help calm me down, and talking to you has been pretty fun, so I'm kind of looking forward to getting to kiss you. <laughs> uh, sorry. Is that weird to say? Not at all. You think? Not uh, I'm not all. sure that I sounded cute, but... Hey, wait a minute. Mm -hmm. You said you'd stop complimenting me. Well, Quit that. I can't help it. You so cute. What do you mean? I don't know how to make you shut up, and I don't want to tell you to shut up because that's rude and mean, and you don't deserve that. <laughs> and honestly, I, I don't want you to because I really like talking with you. Oh, that. Yeah, that makes much more sense. Of course you were talking about kissing. Look, I'm, I'm, I'm just over here. I'm just over here, like... I'm just ready to kiss him now. <laughs> That's all I'm... I'm just, I'm just ready to kiss him now. You know, just put my hands where you want them. Put my hands on my waist. Oh, <sighs> that's your... You want me to hold your waist? Yeah. Is this okay? Am I doing it right? You are. Totally sorry, doing sorry. It. I'm trying to relax, but it you, it's just so you hard. Were... It's okay. <laughs> you gripped me right in China. You see here to be like she grabbing everything right this point. What if I mess up? What if I ruin everything before we even kiss? I don't want to fuck it all up before I even have the chance to... That was sudden. What was that for? Calm yourself down. Oh. Oh, you're right. Now I can't be worried about doing something wrong before you kiss me because you already kiss me. Yeah. You're so smart. I did, yeah. I liked it a lot. Uh, I'd honestly like to do it again. Can we please? It is. Mm, your hands are... Uh, no, no, uh... I like it. Mm. Your hands feel nice. Um, you can touch me more if you want. I wouldn't mind at all. I mean, if you want to, I mean. I mean... <sighs> can I pull you closer? Just a little bit? Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> mm. Uh, sorry. Uh, occupied. Uh, Damn it. Why do they keep trying to interrupt us? Right. Don't they know that we're busy? Wait. Really? 
Has it been that long already? I guess it been. Huh. I didn't even realize. It should have been 14 minutes. Talking about seven minutes. They haven't been so, we was I guess we have to leave now, huh? Time did not exist in that dark ass room, huh? <laughs> it was like, get the fuck out. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of there. Get the fuck out of there now. I got a, I got a shit. Bitch, how about you shit outside? <laughs> <laughs> mm, shit. I was really enjoying spending time with you. For real. Oh yeah? I'm happy to hear that. More. <laughs> Later? <laughs> Later? Uh, I want to see you again, but I just can't tell you who I am. What if you know me? What if you don't like me? What if you can't stand me? But I, mean, right now I'm not really, standing you at really want to get to know you more and maybe well, even do more to... of this with you. But well, it's, it's, it's time to come out the closet and see see who you are and you see who I am. What's up? <laughs> like what? What? Like what? What? See, I'm I'm here. No, I don't care about the lights of the beans. Been a life in the dark, but the stake of you on the way goes up. Skin thick, too tough. Mm mm. Yeah, that's all I gotta say. That's how, that, that's what it is. Yes. But I don't know what I'd do if you figured out who I am and hated my guts and told me that you regretted ever doing this with me. I mean, I'm glad that you think that, but you can't promise that you won't hate me as much as I'd like to believe that. I mean, I want you to know who I am because I want to be closer to you, but I just... I, I can't. I'm too scared. I understand. What do you mean, an idea? I'm not sure there's any way to get around telling you who I am. That seems fairly important. Yeah, I know him. He's a pretty good friend of mine, actually, but what does he have to do with anything? <laughs> That's my friend. <laughs> His end of the semester house party? The one in a couple weeks? Yeah, I'm going to be there. What about you? Mm -hmm. Oh, cool. So we'll both be there, right? So is that part of the plan? So you're saying that if we're both at the party, you think you'll be able to guess who I am without knowing anything about me besides whatever I've said tonight? I mean, yeah, we've been making out, but I don't usually kiss random strangers. Do you really think that it'll work? Definitely, at this point. I'm not sure how cute I am will help you find me, but I'm going to go with it since I know that if I try to argue, you'll just start complimenting me again, and I won't want to leave this room for the rest of the night. You <laughs> <laughs> should be leaving uh, the room right now without seeing If you really think that it'll me. work, then I'm but, willing to okay. give it a shot. Do I'm still pretty nervous about you finding out who I am, but I really want to see you again. Please don't, don't. Do I want to get to know you better, and don't do that shit now. You should probably already locked in now. Yeah. Are you saying you're nervous and stuff? But you better sing. You better bring bring out your your himbo super saiyan, and with all them fucking damn muscles you got, you better sit being so fucking damn cute. See him being so damn cute, being so damn cute, <laughs> being so damn cute. <laughs> Um, yeah. It's, it's space and opportunity. It's all, it's, it's all on you at this point. See if we can be more. So, yeah. I'll see you at the party, I guess. 
Uh, give us a second. I, I really hope this plan works because it really looks like our time's up and I desperately want to see you again. Mm -hmm. Remember you promised to get me all worked up earlier? You've got me excited to see what you have in mind. Please, come find me. I want you to. So I find that so... Like, I guess it's in a dark room, but I would think you would have seen it. Like, my... my see how I'm thinking differently? How I want to... <laughs> my, my ass probably wouldn't even come find you, bitch. I'm, my ass would be like... <laughs> My ass would have been like, <sighs> my ass would have been like already, like I said earlier. I'm like, if they knocking on the door, why are we, are we both supposed to like come out the fucking closet? <laughs> my ass is thinking like that while everybody else was saying to me, no bitch, why the fuck you thinking some shit like that? <laughs> you sound stupid, you dumb bitch. Like that's what they be saying to me. Just because I'm saying, like, bitch, if it's if them if people are knocking at the door, would you want bo you want both of us to get the fuck out the goddamn fucking closet, the door, where the where the fuck that dark ass room was, bitch? I'm thinking it's a bathroom. I think it's a fucking bathroom or a fucking at this point it could be a bedroom. Shit, I don't know. You telling me I have to come find you at the uh, at a different party? Um, no, bitch, you better find me. My I'm right here in your motherfucking face. That's what I see. I'm saying. That's why I'm single. <laughs> Don't see it. You better come. No, bitch. You better come find me. Shit. You, 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 you see. You know. You better come find me with your big ass titties, big ass motherfucking goddamn biceps. Don't you see here, motherfucking goddamn, try to play me, asking me how I need to do this. You know you want to grab this. You grab this. You said, you said, damn, you feel good. Damn, you smell good. Like, damn, like, <laughs> bitch, you better come find me. Find me. You find me. Find me. Then I'll probably think, I'll probably think about it. I'll probably think, <laughs> i think about it. <laughs> Okay, the last one, and this is by Bear Boss as well. It is saved by the hot himbo lifeguard. Please be a different personality at this point. Like, he, yeah, like, like at this point, it's like if I'm gonna get saved, bitch, he ain't that. He, he, that if I'm gonna be get saved, bitch, at this point, oh, <laughs> shit, shit. Shit, what you doing? You, you, you ready to go somewhere tonight? And during the day, have, we have 24 fucking damn hours. Space and opportunity. Space and opportunity. Yeah, he's fine. <laughs> I'm over here. Got me riding on it, riding on it, riding on it, baby. Putting it on this bleed. Them girls do you like hmm? that. <laughs> ah, hey. Good afternoon. Look who it is. Nah, it's been pretty quiet today. Mostly families on vacation. There's just this one group of college kids who think they've been sly about hiding their open containers. Mm. <laughs> nah, as long as they're not belligerent or reckless, we don't call it in. Not looking to bust anyone's balls for no good reason. But if they try to play frisbee by the shoreline one more time, I swear to God. <laughs> yeah. Well, the rules are posted in like six places. Throwing, throwing Balls, in the frisbees, ocean, kites, all. and other flying objects back by the dunes, not by the water. Yeah. You should doing your job. <laughs> yeah. I actually saw like a seven-year-old trip the hell out of one of the college bros. Ah, wow. They were both totally fine. It was more startling than anything. 
But the way this guy went ass over tea kettle was amazing. <laughs> yeah, the mom was more upset than the kid. Uh, but that's pretty normal. Yeah, other than that, no real action today. Uh, there was a toddler who wandered away from her parents two beaches up, but the guard at the next chair found her pretty quick, so no harm, no foul. <sighs> yeah, that's and don't get me wrong, I don't want to sound like a grumpy old man or anything, but uh, we got more, way more of that in the last, I don't know, eight years? Everyone has their nose and their phone and won't watch their kids, but she was fine. Just the toddler running down the beach and giggling. Hmm. But hey, how you doing? Been a few days since I saw you out here. Yeah, just been, you know, busy with school and stuff. You know, <laughs> no, it's just, right how could I forget my favorite lobster? Daylight. First day on favorite the beach, lobster. you ask me 30 questions about riptides, then never go in the water and forget to reapply before taking a nap. Hmm. <laughs> right, yeah, well, you don't look that you right anymore. Oceans. I bet that took a lot of aloe to calm down, though. Hmm. Nah, not really. Sure. I can't remember the last time I got a hardcore sunburn. When we start training for the season, I go hard on the sunscreen, and then once the base tan gets going, it's smooth sailing from there. But I guess I did get a little burnt my first summer on the job. You got your sunscreen. Huh, well, as an expert, if you need someone to get your back later today... I appreciate it, but I already got it already on. Hey. Come on, guys. Back closer to the shore. Sorry. Yeah, like I said, not too bad out here today. Just the college bros. Oh, yeah? Uh, if you don't mind my asking, why don't I ever see you in the water? Huh. I guess, yeah. But it's probably more common than you think. Plenty of families come out here with kids or even adults who aren't the strongest swimmers. A fair, fair. No pressure. I was just wondering. But hey, thanks for stopping by to chat. I enjoy your book. Yeah, I mean, everybody gets to be able to swim. Swim or be by bodies of water, so. Understandable. Forget to reapply in a few hours. Or get or be able to afford a gym membership sometimes, it's understandable. Ah, uh, hey, my favorite lobster returns. <laughs> yeah, true. But I find that if I don't put more sunscreen on my face, sometimes the glare from the sunglasses toasts my little nose a little too much. There's a big difference between sun-kissed with freckles and red-faced like a cherub, you know? Hmm. Uh, speaking of, you've got a little bit you didn't rub in there right under your eye. Oh. No, no, the other side. No, it's still there. Okay. No, it, it, it's... Here, just let me... There. Got it. All protected now. Thanks. <laughs> no problem. Gotta help my favorite lobster. So what have you been? You don't crack. <laughs> sorry, I'm like, I'm not sorry because I'm like he said, favorite lobster. I'm like, bitch, why, I'm, why am I being called a lobster? I'm over here like, bitch. I'm over thinking about this video that I saw. I think it, it was a TikTok video, and they were saying the the one of the girls was talking about why I need to stop eating crab. Y'all need to stop eating crab. How would you feel if you seen her was crack? Well, they were, somebody was cracking your insides and eating and eating you out. <laughs> and the other girl busy. The other girl see it reply to the to the first girl video was so like just open up her legs. I'm like, <laughs> I cannot, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot, I cannot. I just can't. I can't. <laughs> Ah, hold on. Duty calls. Oh, 
me who they saving now. This is supposed to be me. I thought it was that me who was talking to you know what? He going in the water. He going deep a couple feet to save me. You okay? <sighs> Hold on to the float and kick your legs nice and easy. I've got you. Get it all out. Can you kick with me back to shore? Uh, keep holding on. Uh, I've got you. Okay. We're just going to go over this way nice and easy. Okay. Now we're kicking again. Just keep holding on to the float. I've got you. I've got you. Here we go. One more little jump over this way. Okay, now let's really kick. That's right. Get your feet under you. Here we go. How do you feel? It doesn't seem like you swallowed too much water. It's okay. Take it easy. Here. Come sit on the bottom rung of the chair. There we go. Deep breaths in and out. Take it slow. There's no rush. <laughs> Why? No reason to feel embarrassed. Unless you were hoping for some CPR. Uh, in which case, I think you missed your chance. <laughs> Just take your time. I have to signal that we're all good, but I'll be right up top and then come back down, okay? Okay. Okay. How are you feeling? <sighs> good. Yeah, it can be disorienting underwater, even for an experienced swimmer sometimes. No, no, deep. you're fine. Well, no, Please look. I'm over here. I'm over here. Like, already just not even trying to process the trauma that I experienced. He literally swam. You know, he, he was giving me from the ocean. And how deep he was swimming. How deep he was swimming. It was about a couple feet. It was at least good. I don't know how deep. Uh, like, six, seven, eight feet deep. To get me and pull me up. While he had the had the bow the Bowie in his hand in his in his hand to put me in it and swim me back to shore. Yeah. yeah. That's what you call a lifeguard right there. This is my literal job and you shouldn't be embarrassed. Yeah, you get yeah, you hey, be big sometimes you, know, you really get be paid for your job, that's why. Get paid honestly for that job. Souls who are mad at me for saving them because I knew what I was doing and could have gotten myself out. Yeah, I'm serious. So, believe me, you're fine. Just take it easy, dry off, and let yourself calm down. Okay. Well, I mean, if you wanted, I could give you some pointers after five when I'm off duty. Yeah, I you mean sure? it. <laughs> I gotta protect my favorite lobster, after all. Oh, it's <laughs> all right. Just tell me, the time, the time switch just happened so fast. <laughs> hey. Okay, a date. That's what I'm talking about. See what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. Like, just, it's a date. It's a date. It's a date. What? It's a date. <laughs> Attention everyone, the beach is now closing. Please gather your belongings and leave the beach. Thank you for visiting and have a safe journey home. Hey, lobster. Just gotta drag my chair back to the dunes and then the private lessons can begin. You ready for me, bro? It is. <laughs> Don't worry. If I have to save you again, I won't even charge you over time. <laughs> okay, yeah, so time. first things first. Your instincts were good that first day on the beach. You want to know if there are any particular currents on any given day when the tide is going out and if there are any warnings from the guards. Mm -hmm. Well, let's just get on and up to our waists and just go with the waves. 
You want to keep an eye on what's breaking next and how close. If you're in the right spot, you can probably roll over most waves, but if they're starting to break, you can dive under. Okay. Oh, I know, you don't have to always dive, dive, but it's enough to just close your eyes and dunk yourself under. But if there's a particularly strong wave coming, you might want to try and dive under and through it so it doesn't break on top of you. Mm. Yeah, just like that. Okay. It's all in the rhythm and being aware of what the ocean's doing. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> No, cause bitch that time, I remember when I was on the beach, bitch that time, that time, that time, that time was coming in strong, it was coming in strong, I said, bitch, wait a minute, let me back the fuck up real quick, <laughs> cause bitch, you came in so hard, it, I thought I was sitting, cause usually I was like, kinda, I was like more close, I was still close to the sand part, but still like, like a little bit more like, uh, Knee, le knee level uh, link, but it was going strong. It really splashed all the way in my face. I said, God damn. Let me just, let me just, I'm, it's time for me to walk back. <laughs> How do you feel about going a little further out where the shore <laughs> drops off a bit more? Oh, no. Yeah, you're tall enough. You probably don't even need to really tread water most of the time. As long as you stay about this far from the shore. There's a sandbar about five meters out, but... We don't have to go that far today. Just roll over the little waves and duck under the big ones. Just like okay. that. <laughs> Thanks. I'm glad to know you feel safe with this basic lesson in my experienced and capable hands. I mean, I wouldn't be doing this without your help. <laughs> yeah, Any? I've kind of always Any? been around water. And my family would come out here every summer since I was really little. I don't even remember not knowing how to swim. Mm -hmm. I don't know, I thought about joining the Coast Guard for a while while I was in high school, but I decided to keep my relationship with the ocean a little more cash. <laughs> mm. uh, I do have a regular day job the rest of the year, yeah. Okay. So, how are you feeling now, bro? A little comfier with the water? Yeah. Yep. Oh, good. I'm glad to hear that you feel comfier with me. Do a little one-two step in the water. Don't worry, I got you, lobster. <laughs> it's my sworn duty not to let you go. And, uh, if you ever want some more private lessons, I'm free tonight, and in the evenings, the rest of the week. Maybe we could, uh... Uh, what? Uh, what? Uh, what? <laughs> we can do a, uh, what, what? <gasps> we can do a, uh, what? <laughs> I'm dead. I mean, space and opportunity. Third one, third one, third one ain't scared. Third one ain't scared. See, I'm saving my life. Saving my life. But you better sit here and fucking make, make the move right now for your lobster. You ain't gonna crack my motherfucker. <laughs> you gonna eat this ass. Be some hom hom bitch. That's some hom hom bitch. You better. <laughs> I'm so sorry for being so vulgar, but hey. Pass me. I enjoyed it. I've enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. But I'm telling you, that's why I say I'm. Not, I, don't, I, I, I have to face out, face out the fears, you know, face out the, face out the trauma, face out the triggers. Cause this shit wouldn't be. That would not. That all that would not be me. You probably, I probably had got picked once, you know, like people testing your gangster. But when you see and say you have to stand the fuck up, stand the fuck up, because it's like at this point, that's why I respect. Like I can't. I don't know about about about. About, about baddies, but for me, that's why I respected like Bad Girls Club, because there might have been some 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 shit that was just petty, but like it's thing things where it gets to the point where you like seeing breaking their things and um ruining their clothes, doing like putting bleach in contacts, 
At this point, bitch, y'all, no, at this point, I'm, no, I'm beating your ass. It was you, bitch. It was you. It was you. <laughs> so, I'm supposed to be, I'm supposed to be non-volatile and, and calming or an ASMR. Clearly, I just want to, that's the fuck I tell you, bitch. <laughs> Take care and stay vigilant out there.